Well, it's like everyday working. It's about the tension of the muscles to create the correct posture on the hair position for having the fastest revolutions in air. Grazie, i talloni andiamo a stringere, non chiudiamo qua sopra. Andiamo a diventare tallone verso il basso, mignolo su mignolo. Qua lo spazio è molto piccolo. Attenzione, lo dobbiamo chiudere in questo modo, voglio la destra tesa, la sinistra tesa. Adesso facciamo la prima figura verso il basso, la seconda figura verso l'alto. Quindi chiudo, apro, prendo, chiudo. Senza perdere il centro di rotazione. Well, the most important thing is to feel the sensation that is like each muscle is going toward the center of the spin. So actually our body needs to be completely straight and we need to feel tension until like the very last moment. There's nowhere space for a low level tension and this is really important for the jumps because if you want to rotate you need to go as fast as you can in the close position, tight position until the moment you land from the jump. Okay, thank you. Immaginate quindi una chiusura più veloce, un'apertura e un momento di chiusura verso il salto in tensione. Quindi quello che facevate a terra lo portiamo in aria e continua a girare. Ok? like when they learn to rotate in this position because the right is straight and you have the left hip up some space in between the leg and the blade has not to be maintained up but the touch of the two boots is important and to fix down the tension counter tension because the rotation will be try to open the foot and you have to use your muscle to fit to feel that the feet are blocking each other 
motivo del salto è di spingere verso il ginocchio destro e di alzare l'anca a sinistra in alto. Se no mi succede che io the tension of the body and the hip open will be really useful on the first part of the rotation because we need to create the momentum for rotation so the moment we take off and um, the left hip is opening and then the momentum we close it will be like the maximum of speed to create the rotation of triple and quads dall'incrocio indietro e sull'esterno facciamo un tollup semplice nel momento aereo portiamo il ginocchio già in questa posizione e cominciamo la nostra rotazione come questa quindi voi incrociate indietro la nostra parte tenete bene il filo giro, sacco un'apertura manuale Every day we can add one kind of jump and we input this exercise to feel, um, as we were saying, the maximum of speed on the moment like the hip are going out of the circle. So this speed out of the circle and the reconnection together will be creating the maximum of speed. So in this moment after the lockdown we work on basics but I'm already thinking into single and simple exercise, not thinking about the technique of single, but the technique of triple and quads. Fino interno indietro, esterno, quindi prendo la curva, 3, doppio tolup e immediatamente giù. Vediamo di fare Anna questo, apri e apri il ginocchio. Yes.
usually we should maintain the right hip and the balance toward the circle being able to use uh, not a really deep depends if it's triple or double and depend by the speed but it's, a, it's an outside edge and then I should be able to transfer my speed rotation of the right foot toward the direction of the solid so actually the right is skating and the left is touching and often happen that the skater goes down with the hip so my idea is to follow like the outside edge hold the circle, hold the circle and then being able to get in the right takeoff. Yeah,